Face masks are being used almost every day in society at the moment, but are they always absolutely necessary? Let's talk about it. Hi guys, I'm Jay Nunes. Welcome back to the channel. Before I get started, do me a favor, do yourself a favor, click subscribe and ring that great notification bell so that you know every single time that I make videos. Now, let's get into this. Since the outbreak of the whole COVID pandemic bullshit thing, face masks have become an everyday occurrence in society. And I can't help but feel that the rules of wearing a face mask have become a little bit too excessive. Wearing a face mask is not a new concept. Over 100 years ago when the Spanish flu tore around the world with influenza killing millions of people, face masks were common. A quick Google search will show and prove that to you. So it only makes sense that during this pandemic we did the same sort of thing. But some of the rules and restrictions of wearing them have become so over the top that you really think you can't make this shit up. Now, I won't find the clip for you, but recently one of our health ministers over here in Victoria basically said that if you're at home, keep your windows and doors closed because COVID is out to get you and it will find you. Now, I'm sorry, but I call bullshit. As if a virus is walking through the street waiting to see an open window or an open door. Uh, closed, closed, cl ah, it's open. I'll just walk over there. Uh, hi, what'd you want? Uh, hello, my name's Corona. You can call me COVID if you want to. I couldn't help but your door was open. Do you, do you mind if I come in? Uh, well, yeah, I, I do mind. I'm, I'm just watching Netflix at the moment. Oh, no, 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 it's fine. Trust me, you won't even know that I'm here. Apart from maybe 10 days later. I know. Stupid. But the problem with giving such ludicrous health advice from the top of the political tree is that too many people buy into the fear. And let's face it, that is what it is all designed for. And we can see this played out all over the country, all over the state, all over the city of Melbourne where I'm living, by how people wear their face mask and where. I'll give you an example. I like to go for a walk on a daily basis up into the forest. It just takes my mind away from all the current bullshit. The amount of people I see walking by themselves wearing a face mask in the middle of the forest. And I have one question for these people. Are you absolutely bollocking fucking crazy? Do you really believe for a moment that COVID-19 or any other viral disease is waiting in the trees and the bushes for that opportune moment for you to walk past for them to just go, ah, got you. If you're one of these people who goes for a walk by themselves, take your fucking face mask off. Be courteous, have it with you, so if you walk past other people, you can put it on if you think you need to. But if you're by yourself, take the fucking thing off. And that brings up another valid point. You'll be walking, not wearing a mask. Somebody else is walking to you, not wearing a mask. You make eye contact with each other. Suddenly, well, their mask goes up, so you think, okay, I better put my mask up as well. And then the moment that you walk past them, they take their mask off. You've walked past each other for literally a second. There is no way in hell you're going to transmit a virus like COVID or the flu or anything else like that. Are you out of your fucking mind? And that is what is fucking crazy about these restrictions and mandates of wearing a mask. If you're outdoors at all, you must wear a mask. If you're indoors at all, you must wear a mask. Seriously, wearing a mask outdoors by yourself. If you are walking around and you see someone doing that, laugh at them. Like, don't make them feel overly bad, but make them question themselves. I'm not saying that it's okay to make people feel bad, but you know what? You can make them realize that they're a bit of a brainwashed dick. If you think in yourself, people can't be this paranoid and crazy. Yes, they really are this paranoid and crazy. A few days ago when I was going on my walk, a lady's walking towards me, I'm walking towards her. Being polite, I veered to, to pass around her, giving us ample distance between ourselves. But what she did is she stopped, she turned around, waited until I passed her, and then she turned around to keep walking. Fucking stupid. She was wearing a mask. I put my mask on as courtesy, and she still did that. Wake the fuck up, people. Seriously. If you're walking outdoors, you are not going to catch a fucking disease, especially by just walking past somebody for a few seconds. But it doesn't stop there. And I think that the height of lunacy about wearing a face mask are the people that you see driving their cars, wearing their mask, and no one else is in the car with them. That's right. They are in their car with no other passengers wearing a mask 
to protect themselves from a disease that they can't catch inside their car. And to those special, special people, I have a question for you. If you wear a mask when you're driving by yourself in your car, do you also wear a condom when you masturbate? And if you're sitting there thinking to yourself, eh, why would I wear a condom when I masturbate? It's not like I can make somebody pregnant. That is exactly my point. Who can we blame for the fear and all the paranoia? Well, of course, the media and the fucking politicians. They have done a wonderful job, as I said before, of spreading people apart, segregating each other, making people feel absolutely fearful, and also causing divide and potentially hatred as well. So seriously, if you are somebody who wears a mask constantly, relax. You are not gonna get a disease if you're out there walking by yourself or if you just walk casually past somebody else. Unless you, of course, grab a hold of them, make out with them and do some sort of fucking river dance where you're really, you know, breathing on their face. Seriously, it's not gonna happen. One of these days, all this bullshit will be a thing of the past. We will no longer have to wear face masks. Are we gonna adjust to society? where we can walk past somebody or talk to somebody without having something over our faces? <gasps> I know, what a radical idea. It can be done, people. Remember, we did it before, we can do it again. But drop the fucking fear, drop the bullshit, don't be a fucktard. So let's summarize. Stop wearing a face mask if you are driving by yourself or walking by yourself. Oh, and if you're one of these really special, special people who wears a face mask in their own house by themselves, I'm sorry, but you are beyond help. Calm down, don't buy into the fear and the panic, okay? If you get a disease, your body will fight it off and chances are high that it will not be COVID because the news has clearly said that no person who has got COVID has received it from outside transmission. Google that, I promise you it's true. Well, there you are. I'm sure that has shed some light on the whole mask wearing culture that we currently have. Do me a favor now, comment below. Let me know what you think. Are you somebody who wears a mask regardless because you are fearful of catching any airborne disease? Or are you somebody who agrees with what I'm saying and the whole mask wearing thing, especially outdoors, has gone a little bit too far? I'd love to hear from you, so drop me a comment below. In the meantime, guys, subscribe to the channel, ring that bell, and I'll see you next time. I wonder if there's people who wear face masks when they're having sex. Just a thought. Just a thought. <laughs>